Hey everyone, Son of Beast here. Welcome back to the Stanley Cup Playoffs of the Conference Finals. This time, we are about to do the Eastern Conference Finals in between the New York Rangers and the Florida Panthers. The Rangers have picked up an upset right over against the Carolina Hurricanes and Florida Panthers knock out the Toronto Maple Leafs of the Canadian team. Now, we got another matchup in between the first and second seed this time, it's about to be happening here in Sunrise, Florida. So, it's time to bring things into the game and get started. The matchups are currently as follows, as Artemi Panarin, Adam Fox, Mika Zibanejad are the starting three players from the Rangers, and from the Pampers we have as Jonathan Herberdu, Alexander Barkov, and Aaron Ekblad. Now let's get started for the first game. I will be commentating for this game along with the other two that will be here along the sideline. That will be Lightbulb and of course OJ. Yep, that's what we're definitely going to do here. It's going to be a lot of fun here to get started in between New York Territory and Florida Sunrise Island to get things up here in the Sunshine State. Let's get started here for the first game of Eastern Conference Finals of the Stanley Cup. Lots of fun out there, and this is time to get things down to business. Florida and New York on EA Sports of Stanley Cup Conference Finals. Opening face-off is about to set things underway, and we are ready to get going. The Panthers are starting their game, and we are underway. Here's Weger up here as the Sturkin has a save here. Along with the goalie matchups, it's the Sturkin versus Bobrovsky. Bobrovsky, the only one who wants to try to like take things up here on the board. He now knows his stuff, and he helps his player. But for real season of his game, he couldn't save at all. So it was very hard for him to try to like keep the man advantage out there. It's very hard to try to like stick it in control right down there, and it may be very hard, hard one to try to keep it down the range. Icing will be the call here on Lafaniere for New York. Here along with the uh, broadcasting crew here in between Sun of Beast and Lightbulb. No score just yet in the first game. Take a big hit down in the icing zone. Here's Fox. Allow the board here to Zibanejad. That pass is broken up. He swings over to Verhege. Florida's regaining control back in the offense now. He swings over to Fox. Fox moves inside from the wing. Shoots a one. That shot blocked his front. Lindgren has the control up at the puck. Barkov, Barkov, this is up back the other way. He swings over to Verhege. Shoots one. Gloves saved by Shesterkin and now will hold up here for Miller. Miller's got a great uh, feed here and and, and not to be confused with uh, with uh, Devontae Miller, he, he's not you know, then JT Miller. He, ne he really never got it all here when he would like, like to start things up here before. And sometimes I like to see if the, if the players wanted to get right into hydration, they might want to give it all. Panarin just passes off to Miller. Sick lifted but holds it on tight. Fox outside. Takes a shot. That's stopped by Bobrovsky. Bobrovsky got a great feed in control. Now he knows he can try to like help the defenders out do offense and try to pick up their run. In between the attacks and zones, it would be nice if we see one here for tonight. Miller moving back over and Trubo reaching out again the zone. Duclair has got the own end and then puck control releasement. Here's Panera and bad pass is given. Fling back around the board and Sabanaja takes it back. Oh, and he misfires one. This one's way too far. Yeah, it's not going to be very good to try to like keep things out of the range. You don't want to like try to reduce your zone. You want to try to keep it eyes on the uh, open man and don't get it in front of it. Pass up to Benera and it's already up into a wall. Truba back passes to Miller. Moves one inside. Deflected wide off by Bobrovsky. 
Shoots one in there, and that's stopped again by Borowski. Over to Ubeck the other way. Scooping it along the way. Rebounding save comes in by Reinhardt. Weaver up. Seeger up here with the Shesterkin save. Now Benera and the team will have to catch the grip. The faceoff is coming up. Aaron Ackblad, he had it bombed out here with the leg. And he was trying to get him right into control. But it looks like that the leg was already bumped out from the, uh, from the foot. It looks like the puck got him. And he really did have it all. He's, he was definitely not returning here for the game. So it looks like that's going to be an out for the first game for the start for the Florida Panthers. Not so good. Not hard enough at all. It didn't really try to like take it all but they have here. It's very tough and painful. That's going to hurt the uh, upsetting fans to try to keep their guns in, in the rows. Here Lundell. He blocks a shot. Now swings over to Gauthier. New York back in transition to play on offense. Takes a shot. That shot went wide and broken up here by Gauthier. Now Schneider back the other way. Block the pass. Gauthier. And it's tipped it, tip it with the puck control. Fires along the board. Take a big hit, and Jones will hold on to carry things the puck right along the board. He swings over to Rooney. The Rangers are picking back in offensive zone to make the entry. He swings over to Tippett. Tippett moves inside. Bruno Wing in zone. Stop by the circuit. And they will have to hold the puck here for the faceoff coming up. Steams are ready to be here for the faceoff. Still the early score is given up with zeros ahead. Horsling foul took a big jam out there. Saved up again. That's stopped by Shisterkin. Shisterkin really got it all down in there. He was trying to gain his control momentum out there. He really wanted to like try to stop him. Miss fires off and wide, and Shisterkin will have to defend it off to the uh, to the uh, offender player. McKay fires the puck to over. Now McKay has it. Up to Fox. Back to Lindgren. Lindgren swings inside. Rudy saving one big. Scores! His first one comes in for New York to pick up 1 nothing. What an easy feed here for Kevin Rooney. He now has it all down here on the board. He had it stopping. He was never going to cover and catch him right back into the uh, zones. Rangers have one nothing in the lead here. An early score coming down to the mid-period. And this one will be back into the other way to try to pick it up. Here's Fox. He flies over to Zabanajad. Up to Kiel Kreider. And Zabanajad reaching back over to Lafaniere. Now here's Kreider back to Lindgren. Takes the pass over to Fox. Back to Lindgren. Mid-period is passed as right now we're under mid-period to play in the first. Lindgren up to Fox. Back to the offensive zone inside. Flings the puck over to Kreider. Kreider shot. Then got a traffic. See Benedict captures the puck. He's over to Kreider. Now he's over to Lafaniere. Up to Lindgren. Back to Fox. Back to Lindgren. Shoots one. Hammers a block and a stick has been notched out and they have a new replacement to begin here. I haven't never seen a uh, puck one. And also with the broken stick, he really was trying to like help it on. And in the end of the puck around the control, it looks like they're going to have to clean the ice down. Ball call right into the wall. Into the wall. Miller blocks that shot. Fox delivers to Zabanajad. In the attacking end. Fires right into Lafaniere. And it's Montour with the block pass. Flores in control in transition in offense. Shoots one. And another makes a save. Puck regains control for Marchman. Marchman up into the wall, and it went bang out. Bang it out is the very the biggest devastations of the game tonight. Can be a little nightmare in between the 
the two of the uh, guys, it might be a hard one to try to take their cover. It never really caught on, but it's really like, tough to try to like knock things over again. Fox swings over to Lafayette. The Rangers are back in offensive zone. Take a big hit, but Fox holds it on. Back in releases, gets knocked down by Duclar. And Aaron takes it away. And he went knocked down. The Florida Panthers are looking like they're going to like try to hurt someone. And someone has to call 911. Exactly. Ah, uh, man, rush. Here we go. Oh, stop made by Shostokin. That stops it up with 531 to go. Both teams are set for the faceoff. The Rangers have one nothing here in the first period with a shocking surprise. The winning faceoff dishes out and to find heel. Here's Luke Galfier. He swings the puck around over to Hunt. Back me over to Snyder. Releases and it's knocked out by Bobrovsky. Snyder back to Jones. Swings one, fires a two wide and it went off the target. Target can be a very challenging idea to try to help them make successful. It really don't, didn't try to like help them out. They need something else to try to like keep the man advantage here and try to hold on with the puck in control. They have to do something here very quick and try to get back in the zone on offense. Hunt shoots and it's stopped again by the uh, offensive players again. Snyder gets the puck here in the defensive zone. It's taken away by Goodrow. Shoots! It's not stopped by Shesterkin. And we got a whistle to play here for the faceoff. Both teams ready for the faceoff to get back into work. New York wins defensive zone. Reeves spins it off to McKay. Fortin back to Gudas. Gudas shoots! Stopped again by Shesterkin. Fires the puck deep to McKay. New York back in working offensive zone. Lashinen up to Hornpiss. Up to Uyghur. Back to Lostrenin. Shoots it side. That's stopped by Shesterkin here and Miller will hold back over to McKay. In the attacking zone, New York Rangers. Backing pass and Hornpiss with the steal. Not a good open sight. They gotta find the man opener. They don't want to leave it in behind. Wow, the big hit was a little bit slanged out. New York back in offensive zone with under two minutes. Truba back in the, uh, in the wing. He fires back to Lindgren. Back to Truba. Now moves it over to, again, to Zibanejad. Fires it across to McKay. That's reached out for a Uyghur steal. The Panthers are in transition. Taken away here by McKay, Retruba. Last minute to play here in the first period. It's 1-0 for New York. McKay kicks it over to Strom. Take a crack of it. I will pitch it back over to, to Truba. Lafayette try to hold it back here for to McKay. Back pass to Lindgren. Lindgren up, shoots one. That is deflected up and up onto the goalie. Almost had it in there. It's tougher to try to keep their range out of the target. They need something else to try to keep the main range out of it. Lafayette going for it. Bucket scores. It's Lafayette, a buzz beater in the first period. It's now a two nothing lead. You talk about Lafayette trying to hold up with the puck. He waits and waits and waits, and now he has that backhand trying to pick up a revenge where he had it before. He knew he was getting a little bit deemed off. Because of that one here, the Herm Kings are like already in place, but not for Lafayette. They have it all down and below. First period ends it off for 2 nothing Rangers. We'll be right back with the second period. Fun speed are made. Congratulating for Lafayette. On now to the second period of the first game in the Eastern Conference Finals. We're back on ice time. So glad you could join us here as the score has picked up 2-0 along with the buzz beater of Lafayette. 
He fires it off to Zibanejad. New York's picking up pressure of steam. Barkov with the save. Tries to go over to Gudas. Moves it over to beat Verhage. Take the way by Stroll. And Uyghur takes it away. He finds over to Barkov. Back to Verhage. Eyes to Uyghur. Shoots one. That's saved again by Shesterkin. Shesterkin really got a lot of all coming down in the wire and pressures in below. They really have something else to do. Just he had it. But sometimes it wasn't too well enough. Truba swings over to Lafaniere. Gouda takes the puck here and with the puck steal. Panthers back in offense. Verhage inside. It's taken away by Truba. Goodrow's got the puck. That's just set out of reach and Goodrow holding on tight. Truba holding in front. Marchman takes a stay, steal and taking the poke check. Now Bennett. Got to hold it in front now. Gudas inside. Stop by Shesterkin. And he'll have a whistle and buck you to give it a man advantage to take a breath. Both teams are set in the faceoff. The Rangers have 2 0 lead here in the second period from the first. Now Charian fires the puck right over and over to the goalie's net. It's too wide for him. Gotta like try to like keep it focused. Yeah, big hit. Marchman trying to like deliver the stop. Good row up to Stroh. Truba trying to watch out for Bennett. Pokes check the way and Lindgren tries to take it back. Good row moves it back the other way. Shoots one. Saved by Bobrovsky. He's holding a puck here as the puck will be cleared away to get a face off coming up. New York with the faceoff win. Fox leads over to Lindgren. Moves back to Fox. Trying to pull around it. Goff here, backing over to Lindgren. Lindgren gets sweeped out. Goff here shot. Deflected again by Bobrovsky. Puck is slammed down the ice over on the other side of it as they will have to reset here for offensive zone. They got to do something here quickly because they can't lose their man advantage out there or else they could take the puck away and try to keep it out. Tippett right to Rundell. Rundell back to Tippett, shoots and stop by Shostokin. In between the uh, goalies, we have OJ taking his time. Shostokin has it all here because of a save bait that has been breaking out for one of the second time of the most players of the game. The team right now what we have to look for is Bobrovsky. The players are really are trying to keep their eyes on him to go for an open look. And the advantage has it all him down. If they don't have the man advantage here, we're never going to succeed it in time, said for the head coach for the goalie of Bobrovsky. He doesn't want to quit. He never wants to lose it. We'll keep the eyes on the goalies here in between Shosturkin and Bobrovsky. Guys, back to you. McCann moves over to Reeves. Shoots one inside of it. Stopped by Bobrovsky with a glove sink tight. Great job for the uh, goalies here so far. They got a great cover. It's lots of time left here to play on ice time. The goal is now turning to be a 2 nothing lead in between. Jones trying to pick it back here. Montour back the other way. Kreider swings the puck around. Marchman will be blammed out. Now he has the puck in here. With the pass, it's Jones with the takeaway. Kreider will hold things puck here alone here as Lafaniere will go back in the offensive zone. Barkov dishes back to Montour. The Panthers regain their group here on offensive zones. In between the battle, here's the Banachad. Here's Kreider. Shoots! Stopped again here. What a great stop by Bobrovsky. You call that one here a great saving this one. They're going to keep it out of range of luck. Here's Tippett right in front. One on one. With the shot. Deflected by Shesterkin. 
Racing into the attack, Lindgren. They have numbers here, shoots one, and it didn't hit to save it at that point. The puck went too fast, flying out. Fox trying to deliver it again. He swings off his advantage ad. Inside own, shoots one, and it's stopped by Bobrovsky. Hold the puck here as we have a clear sheet of ice coming. Adam Fox was only the one who wants to do things like he can never want to do this game before. The tape to tape zone ability has it all uncovered out with the players that he can try to find an open pass in between. Whenever it's a man on opener or in between the passing zones for the one time shot. We'll see if Adam Fox can try to deliver things up here if he has the right timing to go for it. Back to you guys. And he scores! Tippett gets it in! They're now on the board! Pampers are on the board! It's 2-1 in the second period. Wow, the great feed hustling out there. Tippett, my goodness! They got a lot of way to put things down, and now he messes up on Shostakin. Now they're in ahead. Schoen faces up to Lindgren, back to Truba. Puts it over to Goodrow. Tip it back the other way. They pass the mid-period left here in the second period. Now this swings it off, and back to Reinhardt. Shoots one, scores! It's 2 now on the board. It's now picking up a tie game for Reinhardt's first goal in the conference finals. Rangers pick up their face-off win. They're now on the game, and we got a penalty coming up. That will be Florida with a hooking call. Norbertu into the penalty box that calls for slashing, and this one is not going to be a great succeeding for here to try to pick things up. New York Rangers will be on the first power play for tonight here in the Eastern Conference Finals, here for the timing separates. And we have Weger. Puck clears out the board. He finds over to Miller. Regaining in control, New York. Finds Hedl, shoots one, he scores! Back in the lead, and it's Hedl's first goal in the power play. Well, that's a great feat, yeah, what a stop, yeah. That looks like Keandre Miller got the right timing. And, and Hedl, what a play through. And Rangers are on here on the board. They got a great advantage. Rangers breaks the tie chain as this one breaches up a 3-2 as Herbadu is out of the penalty box. Now this will be right back into even strength. Miller and it's Benetics is still saved up by Zestorkin. Breaches over to Strom. Picking puck passes and Brobrovsky will hold on to the puck here with only 8.39 to go. Both teams are set, ready for the face-off puck drop. Bram Panfer is back the other way to go for the defensive zone win. Herbadu back the other way. And his wing, looking for an open man. Bennett went down, hard and impact. He's never going to lose his patient out there. He really does have it all that's standing out. It's a tough one to try to go for the uh, in players inbounding to try to save it all. What a stop by Shesterkin as Hunt will hold it on. Hedo with the puck. Went down hard as Hunt holds on. Flyers scores! Hunt releases his first goal in the conference finals. They has four goals. What a booming shot he had. He had taken his time, right through the legs and right through the goalie. He really wasn't going to try to save it at that point. He really didn't try to have to hesitate. He really likes to take it in there, just like he did. Rangers up lead their score 4-2 over Florida in the first game. Here's Weger back the other way to Marchman. Fox takes it over away. 
Now moves over to Lafayette. Rangers picking up steam. Lafayette scoots it back over to Lindgren. And picks up a bam knockout from Marchman. Marchman was going to like try to like take his time and try to like bam the net. He was matching his way down and he was never going to stop him to try to do things thing again. He is being a star right out of his hand. Zibanejad blocked up here at the ice side is the call. Offside, I meant. Both teams back into the offensive zones, right near the blue line in a neutral zone. New York back into position. Lindgren gets beaten out, and this is another Florida attack. Florida's attack are really going for a great strategy. The ability had it all down here when he had it here before. But they're never going to try to like slow it down and try to keep their eyes in the rhythm. They got some a lot of a huge place to make that stop. Snyder fires the puck from deep. And the offside of icing. And the icing has been called here by Panera. Teams are ready for the opening faceoff here, right down from the out, from the Florida zone. The score is 4-2. Higher skills average for New York. Now La Panera swings over to Jones. Over again to Panarin. Panarin keeps the puck in clear. Finds over to Snyder. And a bad pass releases up here for Jones to pick it up. Scoop up along the boards here is Lafayette. Fires the puck over to Snyder. Panera with the short pass. Back to Jones. Puck lifted. And over to Reinhardt. Didn't have much time to think about it. He just lost the puck. It didn't really caught on that much here. No way he couldn't get there right like he did. Panarin shoots one, shot blocked, and it's deflected off to Barakovsky. Barakovsky with the save. Teams are in back in producing tradition inbound. Rangers have 4 2 leads still in the head of the game. Yeah, we are under right now, 3 3 to go here in the second period. Now he reaches over again, and the icing is on Florida. Lots of time left here to play for the Florida go zones. The Florida Panthers are looking for a way to get right back down by one if they wanted to get there right in time. They do have it. They, they really need to keep their puck and rhythm out there. They need someone else to try to like help them out. They can't lose their focus. Truba almost went into the goal of that. Truba shakes it off and now he fires the puck to Goodrow. Goodrow went badly ankle broke. Strong, and it's taken away by Gudas. He plays over to Bennett. Take a little bumper car here and put it under the pressure of the wall to go back to offense. Hunt reaches over to Miller. He'll pass and pick it up. Up to Hunt. Reaching back over again is Miller. Pax takes away by Bennett. Battle up to Uyghur. Up to Kukar. Truba takes it away. Up to Hunt. Fires across the needle. Florida and Panthers, and here comes the, the attack for New York. Who shoots one? That shot went blocked. Last minute of the play here in the second period. And here's Marchman's shot. That's stopped by Shesterkin. Shesterkin really got a good hand of it. He pressured it a lot on the boards. In between timing and timing, it's very hard to keep your eyes on your players and do what you get to the right timing to try to keep them in range in motion. Lundgren back to Fox. Now back to McKay. He swings over to Lindgren. Back to Fox. Seven seconds to go. Fox one shoots and he's it's tipped away by the goaltender. McKay back to the other way and he will hold the puck down. That is it for the second period. The advantage for Florida is putting back bad in position. That's for New York advantage, 4-2. Third period is coming up after the break. 
Teams are back on ice, and we hope you enjoyed the rest of the first two periods in between Florida and Pampers and the New York Rangers. But this is all comes down to the third period of the first game in the conference finals before heading to the second game. It has been a pleasure to be having with you here as we have 4-2 ready to go. Wow, Kreider got a goal. He is delivering a slap shot. He is. That's a transition out there. Most of the teams don't really like to see Kreider going for it. What a shot. And not to be confused with that, it's Kreider releasing his second goal here in the game. So far and ever, he really likes to help their team out, but he has it all down there to try to hit the, hit the deck. That's a boarding to take their advantage by. Here's Gudos, right over to Verhege as the score's now 5-2. Broken up the stick, have to buy a new one to get another one. It's a Pucks can be really having a hard time to keep the hockey stick back there way they go. They need some replacement to keep his uh, players right into transition to do their own job. Now they're going to have to clear the ice down here with a broken stick. Marchman saved up by Shusterkin, it's Fox with the puck. Now back to Kreider. He swings over to Goodrow. Harkov takes a steal. He moves over to Gudas. Zibanejad takes away. Knocked down again. This was going back to back. Insane score. Fire said it just went bad luck here as Fox will have to handle it down back the other way. And that was not really good because of that one. Too much fault lying pucks here. It didn't really try to like work things up here in the board. They hit the pressure and get right back into it. And here comes the fart. They're going to have to go for it and try to get back into it where they had it from. Their teams are really not that good. This is a, like a hard, heavy impact. They like, try to stop their way run a run. Zibanejad like, really wants to like try to like hurt things much and try to keep their way on the board and keep it out of range. Now the fight's over. Zibanejad takes out the upper player of Verhege. And the both teams will have to head to the penalty box. This is a lot of a working hard moment out there. Verhege was playing a little what's up moment here. I have a little physical fight. And for Zibanejad, he wasn't ready to be prepared yet. So it looks like he had it all down and tried to help them out to try to like stop them. And the man was already down. It was a too much beating pressure. It was too much for him to regain their group. Bennett back in the offensive zone now. Shoots one and saved me by Shusterkin. Now swings over to Truba. Dishes off to Goodrow. Broken pass by Weger. Declares back to Bennett. Scoop up along the board and away. Finds Duclair. Stop the save and deflect it out. Too much congestion out there. It wasn't really that tough to like try to keep this range on a board of momentum out there. They really have something else to like keep them right right into the target. It's a lot of a uh, lot of a uh, lot of banging out there. Like too much to put to feet. That's a lot of hard uh, moment to try to keep them out of range. And now right back to Hedo. Scoop it along the board here by Truba. Moves it quickly over to Miller and Duclair on the rod man rush. He's going for it. I to get there in time. Hito with the puck. Try to hold out with the off offside call. Blocked it up by Herberdu. The Panthers regain their group here as, as another one comes up for Lundell. Now he finds Hito. The Rangers back in offensive zone to pick up their pressure. Hito swings off to Truba. Misfires the puck here, and this one will have to carry things off, on, off almost on the offside of the puck. Lundell back to tip it. Moves over to Reinhardt. Left save by Shusterkin. Now we'll hold the puck here for under 14 minutes to go. Both teams are in their lineup. Bar to face off puck. Rangers still have it in front here with 5-2 as they are looking for a way to get right by him. Shot went wide. Lundell trips it out. Here's another one for Weger. Moves around. Fox takes a steal. Rangers on a big attack. Kreider up the stroll. 
I have no chance luck here for the 201 pass and a goal. It was too hard to make the tic tac toe moment. It's not really like a good eyes to keep the protection out of it. It's very a tough one to try to like keep the range out of sight. They need something to go right into the offensive zone to try to help them out. It's hard that they have. Not really well enough to try to kind of look for the man open offense. And it's very hard to try, try to keep it out of the range. Passes over to Reeves and Bob Grofsky will hold on to the save with under 13 minutes to go. Now ready for face off again. The Rangers still have a free, free lead here. And this one back into lower skills in the score. It's a Panthers winning faceoff. And this communication feed here for Fox. Marchman along the board. Fires it along the offside. He took a big hit. Montour back to Barkov. Reeves takes the puck away. He goes over to Lindgren. Lindgren right to the wing. Scoops it over to Fox. No change up to Lindgren. Marchman back the other way with the puck as the Florida has it on control. Shoots one! That's saved off by Shusterkin. Deep over to Reeves. Reeves in number one strength. Hunt back to Rooney. Moves over to Fox. Took a big bam out there and Reeves will have to try to slide it back and go right back to Rooney. He went big hit on the play, and he offsides the call on, floor, on Rangers of New York. Now the teams are back in offensive plays here in the uh, neutral zone for the faceoff. They got a lot of huge range, range changes out there, a lot of big hits. It's very the tough one to try to keep an eye on here to go for the, the puck control with the attack. Here's the car. Locked it up by Jones. Punt. Fires the puck in deep. That clears the puck on ice. Beats the icing across here will be Lindgren. Sorry, Goffier. Hedo went out of reach. Bannon right to Cherry. The Panthers regain their group here in offense. Back to Herberdu. Our man Rush going inside. Oh, what a stop made here by the defending players of the New York. A lot of heavy traffic out there, and it looks like they hold on tight. They did have it all. It's very tough to try to keep the range out of momentum at sight, but it does seem off to be one of the approving betters of the players. It does stand out their shot. Irvidu trying to hold on, and passes over to Montour. Up to Chariot. Back to again, over to Irvidu. Move around the puck. Shoots one. Stopped by Shesterkin. That saves off a cut of a moment. Kreider up again to another player as Kreider holds on to the puck. He swings over to Snyder. Backing over is Abanajad. Plays the puck. Shot blocked in front. Gains his own through the wing. Marchman up again and that one's picked up a wide and big hit. And Aaron went big down hard. Oh boy, we got a lot of player attacks. They really got something a lot of what worried credits to do. They got a lot of the players. They, they're like keeping attack, attack, attack. They really wanted to get right onto them. They can't lose their man out of range. Strome takes a pass over to Panarin. Florida's back in control. Moves over to Chariot. Flings out to Parkhoff. Up to Marchman. Shoots one in front. That's stopped again by the goaltender. New York back in transition. Strom with the puck. Flanks over to Miller. Stick lifting. Great call on Verhege. Now to stick lift and banged out. Now New York back into offensive zones. Good row with the puck. Shoots one net. He scores! Good row regaining the group. Now their extension is cut down by four. Extending the lead, I should call it. Barclay, good route, a receiving puck in, in, in his own ability. He has a rage out he wants. Barclay, good route, receiving the man to this player. Most of the teams are not really well enough to get to the shorthanded goals. It's hard to try to 
pick up the head and, and go with the uh, bigger attack. So far right now, they got a great heavy impactor in between. And without the bolts, it looks like the Rangers are going to the Stanley Cup Finals of NHL 22 for the first time here of the season. And it might be heavy enough to go with the USA matchups in between the two. Here's tipping up to Reinhardt. Reinhardt moving inside, shoots one, it's stopped by Shesterkin. Truba clears it over, right over to Rooney. Rooney fires the puck as he went down on ice. Gudas has the puck. We're under five minutes to play in the third period. Now swings over again. Back to Lundell. Moves over to Reinhardt. He scores! They're down by three. They're cutting it down to go back with their own goal. That's what they wanted to do. They expired to play with two on one. Pampers regaining back into the offensive zone. Still looking for a player to go right with another goal. To keep an eye on the puck. To go with another one. Here the attack. Coming in for Fox. Kreider on the board. Back to Lafayette. Up to Kreider. And it's not enough in time and good zone. It's out of focus. To better it up. Saved again by Bobrovsky. He's really doing it so hard that time. It's really going to be easier to keep an eye on the puck. Here's Weger up again. That's stopped again by the goaltender. Another great save. Zibanejad. Out of reach and focus. Not enough to make a good moment to keep an eye on the puck and the boards. Foreign takes it away. Weger out. Couldn't have a controlling puck with the zone. As right now, Kreider has one. Lindgren, that's top puck taken away. Fox tries again on the offensive zone to keep the grand pressure. Now finds Stroll up again to Kreider. Kreider went badly bumped. Shoot, scores! Kreider, two goals, and this extension is back up by four. Man, oh man, the team's really got it all down their strength. They got something else to do here. They try to keep their range up what they have. Kreider has gotten two goals here for the first game of the conference finals. The, the clock is pushing down ahead as the Rangers are looking for a way to hit the first win here for the first game of the conference finals. It's very true because they got a lot of higher advantage ability. They did have it all here down, but not for this time. They got a lot of great advantage out there. Only one minute left to play in the third period as a shot is denied up again. Reinhardt back the other way. Barkov with one, knocked down by the goal post and stayed out. He's really going to try to like deliver things off here. He was so close to get a goal, but it was too soon to keep his eyes on the run. Pressure's on for Strom. Back to Truba. Back to Miller. Now swings back to Gauthier. Kudos with the puck. Florida's in now. Under 30 seconds to play. Shoots one, he scores! Alexander Borkov was going to get, try to keep his man advantage here. He's not all alone. He was trying to go for the uh, for the puck to regain their group down by three. The teams are not looking very well enough for here for the start of the first game. They are not ready yet. It looks like they're going to need to try to like help things up here. If they want to get back into offense, they got to make it heavy. With that one, they got a lot, a bunch of working to do to hit the player on deck. We'll see if Barkov can try to pick up another all alone man and help the team out here for the second game. Back to you guys. Eight seconds to go. Gudas with the win of the faceoff. He's moving inside. Stopped by Shesterkin. And that will end the game for the first time for the Rangers beating Florida. It's very difficult. It's very hard to try to like keep the range in motion. And for Shesterkin and the other teams, they have it all down in control. They got a great win here for tonight. And that's your do it here for this game. Along with me, that's to, I'm sorry, me and Lightbulb, along with OJ, 
This has been a presentation of the Eastern Conference Finals. Here for the first game of the NHL 22 in the Stanley Cup playoffs. So far, it's the series 1-0 New York and Colorado 1-0 over the Flames. So it's time now to present the three star players of the game here for the NHL to see who had the most in most average games. 7-4 is your final score. And right now, light bulb will close things off. You take it first. Thank you very much. Number three, we have the ultimate man in the hat owl, Owen Tippett, one goal and assist. He wasn't gonna try to like keep the range out of momentum, but the backhand shot, he had it in front of it. Go right around to circuit to try to blind it. The second star goes to Sam Reinhardt. Only two goals has advanced. Not going to be an assist and not going to be a hit. He really did have it all. And for number one, this all has to be on Chris Kreider. Two goals and two hits. An unbelievable making of this game turns to be a slap shot goal and a breakaway. He got it in front of it all. What a shelf here for the first one in between Florida and New York. Stay tuned for the second game as we will have the next one coming in here for the second game. That will be happening just two days before back in being, being, being uh, played. Tomorrow will be happening here for another one for the Abs and the Flames back at Ball Arena. And the broadcast crew will be, will be Greg, Greg Farrar and Jay Cebulski here for the EA Sports Coverage Zone for their ability to give their all they've got. So that it ends up for the first game of the Stanley Cup Conference Finals of the playoffs. We'll see you around next time for our next game of the matchups. In between the hand, in between of the border of each town face-off matches. Peace out everyone for us a while as the Stanley Cup playoffs of the Con Eastern Conference Finals of NHL 22 dial. Right, this is Son of Beast. Thank you for joining us. Get home safe.